the Google Play Store has more than a million apps on it and over billions of downloads each month. But it's not only the place to get apps. There are many alternate Android app stores out there that you can use anytime you want. We decided to take a look at what's out there. You will need to go into your settings. Security menu and tick unknown sources to allow downloads of non Play Store apps. Let's start with the first one Amazon Underground. Amazon Underground provides you with a huge list of paid apps for free and the list gets updated every week. Apps such as Goat Simulator the new Star Wars game are available for free. Amazon actually pays for the app to the developers on a per minute played basis and then makes it available for free to the user. Even in-app purchases are also available for free. Movies and TV shows are also available at a lower price than the Google Play Store. Next up is Aptoid. Once you launch it, you get a feel of the Google Play Store. It looks and feels the same except for the different color scheme. Aptoid is based on repository based system or stores as they are called on Aptoid. You can also schedule app download times which is a pretty neat feature. With a wide area of apps, it is one of the best alternatives for the Google Play Store. FDroid Instead of having a store, it gives a list based on what repositories you have. New repositories can be added. Most of the stuff is free, the list of the apps might be slim but the content is very good and everything is open source which is a huge plus. As there is often an open source option available for paid apps in the play store. Another feature of FDroid is that all apps that you find on FDroid are free of ads, pop-ups and even in-app purchases. Next is 9apps. Another one of the best Play Store alternatives. It does provide apps that are not available anywhere else, such as TubeMate. You even have different sections for wallpapers, music, ringtones, and stickers. Not just that, top and trending videos from YouTube are also available under video section. You also get coins to download apps that can be redeemed for coupons and gifts. This is not a simple app store, it's a media hub. Then the last, but definitely not the least, Slide Me. It offers free and premium apps in various categories and subcategories, and they all pass through a quality control process, so you can be safe before downloading all these apps. Apps are downloaded directly in APK format so can be easily reinstalled. SlideMe is a good option for developers as well as there is a SlideMe ad network and it is also possible to get higher revenue. But with stores alternatives, there is a risk of viruses and malwares. Although most of them verify the apps, but it is recommended that you install an antivirus first and then continue with these stores. So guys, thank you so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed the video. I'll catch you guys in the next one.